I'm going to go into this Ninox table and I'm going to set up an appointment to start on Thursday the 8th at 10 a.m. ending the same day Thursday the 8th at noon 12 o'clock. The description of the event is going to be a team meeting regarding the new accounting system and it's going to be via Zoom URL or for those who want to attend in person, the main conference room. The participants are going to be Greg, Karen, Leslie, Tom, Cheryl, and Terry. The priority, this is a high priority meeting, and it's going to be with our, obviously, accounting group. And I want to make some notes. No cell phones no laptops, bring good ideas. And that's all there is to it. Now, if I flip over to Calendar Plus, I'm going to see on Thursday the 8th, right here, that we have a team meeting regarding our new accounting system. I'm going to double click to open up the light box or the details of this event, and I can see all of the information that I've put in. The description of the event, it's a high priority, the group that's going to be included, the names of all the people that are in attendance, notes, and location. Now, I would like to make a couple of edits, but instead of going back to the Ninox record, I'm going to make the edits right here inside of Calendar Plus. I want to change the description of the meeting to say New Accounting System Brainstorming Session. This is going to be a medium priority meeting. No cell phones, no laptops, bring good ideas, and most importantly, lunch will be served. And then I want to go in and I'm going to highlight this by making it a nice bright orange with white text on top. And there we go. I'm going to save this event and we can see all of the changes that are made right here. We have our new color, our new description. Oh, and one more thing. I'm going to go down here, and it's not going to start at 10 a.m. It's going to start at 10.30, and I'll save that change also. We see the starting time has been updated here, but if we go back into the Ninox record, we see everything has changed here also. From 10 now, it's to 10.30. The colors have changed. The priority has changed. We've added new people to the attendance list and our new description, and most importantly, everyone is now notified that lunch is going to be served. Now I'm looking at the calendar and I realize this is not a good day to be having this meeting. It's right in the middle of the day, right in the middle of the week. This is gonna interrupt a lot of people's week. I think it would be better if we had this meeting first thing in the morning on Friday. So I'm gonna go ahead and drag this over to Friday I'm going to open it up and we're going to start the meeting not at 10.30, but it's going to be 8.30 and instead of serving lunch, we're going to serve breakfast. We save the change, we go back to the Ninox table and sure enough, now the meeting is going to start at 8.30 a.m. on the 10th. Rescheduling an appointment or editing an appointment in any way is as simple as opening up the appointment, making your changes, and rescheduling couldn't be easier. If you can't do it this week and you need to push it ahead two weeks, we'll take it from the 10th, drag it down to the 24th, and sure enough, Ninox will instantly reflect the change. That's how easy it is to edit appointment entries and calendar entries in the new Calendar Plus for Ninox.